Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video I would be explaining you what is a gas power cycle or Brayton cycle and how the cycle works. Also I would explain you the PV diagram, the TS diagram and how you can do the various calculations and the numericals regarding it. So before starting with the video if you are new to this channel please subscribe my channel by pressing the subscribe button below. Also if you find this video helpful please share this video and if you have any doubt please comment in the comment section below. Also check out my other videos all the links are given in the description. Do follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Google Plus all the links are given in the description. And uh, if you find this video helpful please like the video. Now, now starting with the video. So gas power cycle or Brayton cycle. This is a cycle that employs the air. That is the atmospheric, atmospheric air it uses as a fuel. So Brayton cycle because Brayton was a scientist who discovered this cycle and so the cycle is named after him and this is the PV diagram or the pressure volume diagram and this is the TS diagram or temperature entropy diagram. So the basic cycle represents on PV diagram is from 1 to just like this and on TS diagram correspondingly it is like this. So the various processes are from 1 to 2 it is isentropic compression in the compressor from 1 to 2 so we have to do the work so work is provided from 1 to 2 and from 2 to 3 there is constant pressure heat addition in the combustion chamber we use the fuel from 3 to 4 we obtain the work from the turbine this is the useful work from 3 to 4 and from 4 to 1 it is heat constant pressure heat rejection all right similarly on the ts diagram the maximum efficiency is given by 1 minus 1 upon rp to the power gamma minus 1 upon gamma where gamma is equal to 1.414 and rp is equal to pressure ratio pressure ratio that is p2 by p1 or p3 by p4 because p2 and p3 the pressure is same p1 and p4 the pressure is same so rp is pressure ratio is p2 by p1 or we can say p3 by p4 so this cycle is employed in the jet engine of the aeroplanes or fighter jets and uh, this is the basic open cycle gas turbine gas open cycle gas cycle so here there are three main components that is the compressor, combustion chamber and turbine. The, the air is taken from the atmosphere. It is compressed from 1 to 2 in the compressor. From 2 to 3 heat is added with the use of with the help of fuel. From 2 to 3 combustion is there and this combustion occurs because the air it has oxygen and it already reaches up to uh, some certain temperature from 1 to 3 because from 1 to 2 after compression the temperature and pressure of the air is already increased and from 2 to 3 the fuel is added so just by sparking the fuel and air mixture just as in petrol engines similarly the efficient combustion occurs and then the exhaust of the combustion the exhaust from the combustion is passed from 3 to 4 to through the turbine so you obtain the useful work from the turbine and hence in aeroplanes we see large jet engines so that is this whole hole only it has many series of comp compressors and turbines and many combustion chambers in which the aviation fuel is used and uh, this is the open cycle and this is the main cycle that is employed in jet engines as well as aeroplanes and because of Newton's third law action every action has equal and opposite reaction so when the exhaust gases are propelled from the turbine so they exert a opposite force on the airplane or aircraft and it moves forward it gives the forward thrust now this was the video regarding gas power cycle or Brayton cycle. I hope I made myself very clear and if you have found this video helpful please like the video 
if you have any doubt regarding this video or you want any other topic to be explained or you have any suggestion feedback please mention in the comment section below also please share this video and if you have not yet subscribed please subscribe my channel and uh, till then take care i will see you in the next video take care bye bye wherever i go wherever i see i remember